Hello. In this video, I will tell you about checking the homogeneity of a function for economics or any other mathematical applications. Okay, homogeneity. So, what do you mean by homogeneity? For y equal to 2x squared plus 3xy. Is it homogeneous? For example, sorry, z equal to 2x squared plus 3xy. Is it homogeneous? You want, and if it is homogeneous, then find its degree as well. So, how you are going to find it? Very simple process. Step 1. I always follow a step. Step 1. First, multiply both the variables in the RHS with the particular constant. Let the constant be alpha. Okay. So, z and this 2 alpha x square 3 alpha x into alpha y. 3 alpha x into 3 alpha y. So, at the end, you get 2 alpha square x square and 3 alpha square x y. 3 alpha square x y. Now, from this pattern, now you are going to take alpha square common. So, this is going to be 2x square. 3xy. See, you are back into the old equation. You are back to the old equation. x square, this is the equation given and now you are there. So, what is common now? Alpha has came out common but as alpha square it has came out common. So, it is homogeneous. So, it is homogeneous but the degree is 2. How I managed to say 2? Because the power of alpha is 2. This is the simple process. Now, how to check it is not homogeneous. What happens if it is not homogeneous? Now, there is again an example of non-homogeneous pattern. A non-homogeneous equation is, for example, z equal to 3x square plus 9x plus 7xy. Here, if you take alpha, if you place alpha at the place of x and y, so this will be alpha x whole square 9 alpha x 7 alpha x into alpha y. So this will give you 3 alpha square x square 9 alpha x 7 alpha square x y. You can take alpha common. You can take simply alpha common from this. I hope you can calculate all this by yourself. Now, the main problem, you can take x as well common but we don't need to take x common, only the alpha part we need to take common. If you take this alpha common from here, you see we are not back into the old equation. Are we back into the old equation? No. So this is called non-homogeneous. Non-homogeneous. So if it is non-homogeneous, there is no point in finding the degree of homogeneity. So this is all about finding on checking whether a function is homogeneous and in homogeneous what is its degree.